Hi, welcome to Beat Batter Bake with me Priyanka. Today I'm in a mood to do something very creative. So we'll be taking a bit of vanilla batter and then a little bit of chocolate batter, mix the two together and come up with a creation that will have people saying, "Oh my god, how did you do that? Are you excited? Let's get going." So let's start with weighing our dry ingredients. We need 200 grams of regular flour, 1 teaspoon of baking soda, then just sift it together. Okay. Next, let's take 240 ml of plain milk, room temperature, 1 teaspoon of vinegar, just whisk it. Then we add 200 grams of sugar to this. Okay, just give it a nice stir. Next to this, we add 120 ml of neutral oil. Give it a nice stir. Okay, we are done with this. Then add your dry ingredients in two batches and then whisk. Now second batch and whisk again. It should just come together so that there are no lumps. Now we will divide the batter in two. One will have vanilla and the second one will have cocoa. Now in the first bowl we will add a little vanilla to taste. Just give it a stir. Alright. In the second one, we'll sift in 3 tablespoons of cocoa powder. Now let's whisk it together. Okay, so our batters are ready. And now let's get to the creativity part. So I have this 8 inch round tin, let's keep it here, it's buttered and flour. So in our butter tin, we are adding 2 tablespoons of vanilla batter. Then followed by 2 tablespoons of chocolate batter. I know this is a long process, but believe me, the end result is really awesome. And finally, to round it up, a large tablespoon of chocolate. And we are done. This will go for baking at 175 degrees Celsius for 30 minutes. Now our cake is nicely baked. It's time for it to cool down. Let's keep it aside for just a few minutes. So the cake has cooled down enough for me to demold it. I'm going to loosen the sides with a knife. All right, I'm done. Now let's demold it and get ready for some action. Again, now is the best part. Now that you know how to get these beautiful layers, it's time you get baking too. Mention in the comment section below which is your favorite cake. I might just try to bake them for you. Bye.